Right now, the state of Florida is bracing itself for Helene. As you mentioned, we are taking a live look now. This is a traffic shot in Florida's Lee County. Choppy surf there flooding the roads already. Yeah, and this is really just a warm up. We reached out to a restaurant there and of course they're slam preparing for the storm. Meanwhile, areas like Tallahassee also getting ready and that's where we find CBS's Tom Hansen. So Tom, how are things at the moment and how are residents there getting ready? Hey there, good afternoon to you. Well, the rain is starting to pick up ever so slightly here, but it is nowhere near what we are expecting to see as we head into the evening hours when those gusts of 130, 140 miles an hour are expected to blow through this area. Now, one of the main concerns here, guys, is the storm surge, and I just want to put myself right up next to this palm tree right here. You can see I'm about six feet if you double me in size. So basically a, a good ways up the palm tree, that is how high a lot of this storm surge could get. And as we know, that can be potentially life threatening. Now, I want to show you around over here. Uh, one of the main concerns here in Tallahassee, which of course is a little bit more inland, as you guys know, are these massive oak trees. These oak trees have gigantic branches and with those gusts of wind and the flying debris that's going to be coming through this area overnight, that is also going to knock these branches down. They could fall, they could be hurling through the air, you know, and that is presenting concerns for power outages. Earlier this summer, Tallahassee had a string of about three tornadoes. All of those tornadoes knocked out a significant amount of power to the city. Now imagine a hurricane, which for all intents and purposes is a gigantic tornado that a gigantic tornado. That is what we're looking at here. That sustained powerful wind and that could cause some serious issues. The mayor here not taking it lightly. Uh, Florida State University students hunkering down for the time being. He is saying that this could be the strongest storm this city has ever seen in its history, guys. A live report from Florida. Tom, thank you so much.